my thoughts coming up for the next game against Punjab Kings is one, it'll be nice to win the toss. So I'll try and speak to Ritu leading into that game, try and make sure that he calls the right ball, flicks the right point. Um, secondly, I think um, it's going to be great taking that momentum from this last game that we have into the next game with bat and ball. Um, and yeah, we're just going to continue trying to perform day in, day out for the fans um, and put them under pressure, particularly with the ball. Um, they've got a lot of momentum with the bat recently with the, the, the high run chase that they had in their previous game. So um, if we can put them under pressure early, that's going to be beneficial for us and we can continue where we left off with the bat. So keeping an uh, obvious bias for CSK, right? So purely as a follower of the game. So do you think the win against SRH uh, is one of the best bowling performance by any team in this IPL? I think certainly, I'm not sure if it's the best bowling performance of every team in this IPL, but I certainly believe it's the best performance we've had so far. Um, you know, we were clinical in all aspects, in the power play, um, the way Deepak and Tushar um, opening the innings was, was pretty special. Getting those early wickets against SRH was very important against their batting lineup. And then I think the way Jadu held it through the middle of the innings, um, building pressure from one end as, a, as the spinner, making it hard for them to hit boundaries was certainly beneficial for us. And I think the way Patty came in as well, um, bowling those death, death Yorkers, the way he got Aiden Markham out was, was really iconic. So um, certainly a special performance bowling, bowling all round. So how do you feel about yesterday's match? Can you pick some of your favourite moments, top three? My top three moments of yesterday's match um, was certainly Ruta Raj, the way he batted. Um, I know that he's been in a little bit of pain recently with his thumb. Um, so for him to go out and do the, the job that he did with the bat, particularly after losing the toss on a slightly slow wicket, um, was really good to watch. Um, and obviously a little bit unfortunate that he didn't manage to get that 100 mark. But um, you know it shows that he was certainly batting for the team and trying to get us the biggest total as possible. Um, my second favourite moment would have been um, Tushar, the way he bowled. Um, you know, he was on a hat-trick at one point. Um, he bowled with serious control um, and put their, their batters under pressure. And getting those early wickets for us was, was crucial for us to build momentum and win that game. And then the other one, just to top it off, was Daryl Mitchell's five catches. Um, I don't think I've seen an outfielder take five catches in a game before. So, um, you know, I think there was a special effort for, from him in the in the outfield. So we are entering the month of May. So obviously it is going to get hotter. So as a player, so how do you tackle this situation? So how do you prepare yourself? Yeah, it's funny. I spoke to the guys last night after the game and they were saying that it was ex like extremely hot last night and, and certainly getting hotter. So um, there was a lot of guys that were pretty dehydrated. If you look at Rutu, I think midway through his innings, he was sort of on his haunches. Um, you know, he's probably very fatigued at that point. So um, as a player, I think the guys are aware of taking as much fluids on board um, and eating as, as much as possible. Um, staying hydrated is very important, particularly in this humidity here in Chennai, um, where the guys are sweating lots. Um, I think that is probably very important and guys will probably take that into their preparation moving forward. So back end of an IPL uh, tournament, it has always been a crunching time for CSK. Uh, so, what do you think is the confidence boost that they have, but then they bounce back to the right side eventually? So, what do you think is the confidence for the entire unit? I think, um, you know, looking at over the past two games, I think the team has taken in a lot of confidence, um, with the bat particularly, um, scoring over 200 on both occasions on slightly slower wickets here um, in Chennai. Um, the guys can take a lot of confidence through that. Um, and also the way we bounce back with the ball, you know, both occasions we've bowled um, where there's been lots of dew, so the ball's been quite wet. So the bowlers can take a lot of confidence with bowling under under pressure with trickier conditions. So um, as you say, you know, CSK are really good at the back end of the tournament. Um, you know, I think they gel well as a team and they've been in these positions a um, number of times before. So they can take that experience from past um, IPLs and moving it into the rest of the com competition, which is brilliant. So uh, your opening partner Rutraj has been very really great with his bat. So what one thing about his batting has impressed you a lot? I think um, one thing that's impressed me is just you know the the good cricketing shots that he's playing. Um, you know he's not trying to be too frantic with the bat. Um, you know he's playing strong cricket shots. He's playing to his strengths. You know the way he's hitting through the offside um, and timing the ball. 
um, has been has been great to watch. And the way he's accumulated his innings um, over the past couple of games has been great to watch. You know, the way he goes about his business, um, manipulating the field is is something I really enjoy watching him when he's playing. The Chepok crowd. Um, do you think Adi the twelfth team member of CSK? Certainly, I think um, every player that plays here at Chepok is is you know does a, is, it's it's amazing experience for them to to see the crowd, um, to see how loud it is, um, to hear how loud it is. You know, even when MS comes onto the ground for warm ups, you can just hear the crowd just lights up and. Um, it's pretty special for everyone to, to experience that and I think um, it's a unique experience because you know it is the fortress of CSK and um, it shows that CSK are very strong at home because of the support of the fans. Starting with you, who is going to be your game changer for the up and coming match? Uh, Patirana with this Yafas. Brilliant, awesome. Looking forward to it. Who's your game changer? Tala Forever. Tala Forever, okay yeah. brilliant. We're looking forward to that. We all are. Who's, who are you looking forward to? Ritu Raj Gaikwad. Brilliant. I like that. He's going to go well. Mine is Shiram Dubey. Shiram Dubey with those six hits. Six yeah. Brilliant. And he's been doing it so well. So um, it's been great I to watch him. So, yeah. Awesome. I look forward to that. Um, I'm going to pick Ritu Raj as well. Um, personally, obviously, he's been batting really well. Um, nearly back to back hundreds. Um, he's timing the ball beautifully. Batting the best he, that he has. Um, and yeah, I can't wait to, to see him go again.